you guys. Okay. So figured I'd come live. Hmm. Automatic. That's cool. How is everyone doing? I'm just going to jump on and do some makeup with you guys. Say hello when you're jumping on. Let me know where you're tuning in from. Hi, Karen. How are you? Do what do I want to do? What do I want to do? I don't even know. What palette should we use? Trying to figure out here. I don't have thought when it comes to what palette I want to use. Let's see about this one. Ooh, we could use the blues in this one. Maybe we'll use this palette. The You Can Be one. One that I've kind of messed with, but not all the way. So let's do this one. So let's do a blue look. Since it's like wintry, whatever. Or at least it's getting wintry. Hi, Chelsea. Forgot my glasses are on. Goofball. Say hello when you jump on. I am working on a schedule. I'm trying my best, y'all. It's a little tough. Ray's hanging out with Cassius right now. He's hanging out with him and he just bottle fed him and so. But like, figuring out time-wise and trying to schedule and stuff has been a little tough, but we'll get through it. We'll get, we'll get it figured out, so we're just, we're adjusting still. Let me know if you guys see me a little clearer now because, um, I have a new phone. <laughs> Hi, Sarah. How are you? Let me know if you guys are seeing me a little clearer now because I'm using the new phone. And I'm loving it. I am. I'm actually really loving it. I worked on a coloring book. I have a special coloring book coming out soon. So get excited for that. Uh, with Ray. With Ray right now. I forgot. I need a puff. Hold on. I keep forgetting to use a puff. There we go. Ooh, look at that. You really can see. <laughs> Share the live over to your page. Thank you. I didn't even have to ask you to do that. Thank you so much. Like I said, I appreciate you being an admin for me. It has been very helpful. All the time. Yeah, Cassius is with his daddy right now. I'm spending a little time with him. Ray loves when he gets home and stuff and he spends time with him. It's when he takes over a little bit to spend time with him, so. He's got his little, uh, bouncer right next to, um, Ray's computer so that Ray can sit there and he can play his game. And also cut, have little Mr. Cassius right there and with him which is adorable because i'm sure when Cassius is older he'll probably want to sit there with daddy all the time it's probably going to be a thing most likely <laughs> so 
so. Whew. I feel like my eyes look really red right now. And it's probably because I didn't get too much sleep. Not this time. I was not, and it had nothing to do with really him. It had to do with me. For some reason, I wasn't able to sleep much. You're so welcome anytime. I appreciate you too. I love you. Love you too. Alright. I love, love, love this foundation, you guys. It is my favorite. It still is. I'm obsessed. It's the baby face. From my favorite link, link that is in my link tree. Okay. And then for concealer, I went and grabbed... What did I grab? I grabbed this one and I grabbed this one. Which one is this? Oh, it's K-Beauty. Okay. And then this one's Wet n' Wild. I think I'm going to use the K one because of the shade. Hi, Katie. How are you? Ooh, I just watched that focus. That's funny. One second. So how are you guys doing? What have you guys been up to? I feel like it's starting to actually get cold here. I'm using a dry blender right now. Do you guys have any questions for me? Other than where is little Mr. Kazi, he's with daddy right now. As we have this room a little better, might be able to have him up here with me. On sometimes when I'm on here. But right now... Right now, it's a little bit of a mess still up here. There we go. Oh, makeup always makes me feel a little better. Okay. Let's go in with the contour glow from Faber Leak. I feel like I want to kind of use a little bit of the darker, cooler tone, I guess is what I want to say. What makeup look will you be doing? I'm not sure. It's going to be a blue look, but I'm not fully sure what I want to do here. Hi, Patricia. How are you? I'm just going to deepen my cheekbone over here. Blue is my absolute favorite color. Hey, honey, how are you doing? Loving being a mama. Yes, I do love being a mommy. I definitely see what people are talking about when it comes to sometimes not having time, <laughs> but that's okay. 
because we're figuring it out. Blue, orange, and pink look gorgeous, gorgeous. Aw, thank you. Yes, I love being a mom no matter what. <laughs> Figuring out live times have been interesting and non-existent right now, but I'm getting there. And yeah, we're still adjusting. It's not a big deal. Only gets easier, yes. So I absolutely love the color blue on you. Aw, thank you. I know blue always looks so pretty with brown eyes. Girl, we got so serious catching up to do since last time. Yes, we do, Sarah. Where you been? Yes, we definitely do. If you want, we can video chat anytime you want to video chat and stuff. And that way I can show you little Cassie. Okay. And I don't remember, I don't think, I think this is more like a subtle highlight. So we'll see. Hi, Teresa. How are you? I think this is more subtle. Yeah, it's got more of like a sheen to it than a shiny type. Yes, ma'am, definitely. Okay. Yeah, it's definitely not really shiny. It's more like a sheen. Which, you guys know, I am into the shine. So, we will grab another one out of the highlight palette. I'd love to video chat with you sometime and see him. Of course, Karen. Anytime. Just let me know. Okay, let's go with this white one because I think that would look really pretty. And then we'll use the blue highlight that's in here for the inner corner um, when we we're doing the blue eyes. Doing okay, how are you and the baby doing? We are good. We are good. We're learning that he's a little bit tongue-tied um, when it comes to breastfeeding, but it's okay, because we're, we're getting there. It hasn't been too bad. Okay, we're going to use this powder blue. Oh, silly me. Did I even grab eye primer again? Or did I forget it? Pretty sure I forgot it. Let's just use concealer. Hi, Stephanie. How are you? And after using... Ugh. Oh, those are my glasses. It's fine. <laughs> You've always loved your highlighter. Yes. This is literally one of my favorite highlighter palettes just because it has like a variety of really lighter shimmer, shiny colors and then really, really bright high-end colors too. But Plus, I love the diamond butterflies in it and stuff. I love this palette. I've talked about it enough with you guys, though. Okay, now let's go into the blue here. I don't know. We probably should use a shadow to kind of set this. I don't really feel like it. So, we're going to go with this powder blue color. It's very light. It's really pretty, though. See how pretty? So what have you guys been up to? You guys know what I've been up to. I've been spending time with my little Cassie. I've been spending time with him. Taking care of him. All about him. <laughs> no. We watch shows together and cuddle. And they snuggle with him and all that. You guys probably see a lot of me in my bed when it comes to my photos with him or if you're watching any of my vlogs and stuff on YouTube, 
You probably see a lot of me in my room and my bed just because we mostly are in there. I mean, I'm still recovering from C-section and everything. I got told that it'll be a couple weeks still, so. Um, Sarah, I have been with multiple companies for a long time. I'm affiliated with a bunch of companies. Um, specifically, I am with Favor Leak, and specifically, I am with, uh, what is it, Rising, is it Lotus? Hold on, Rising Lotus, I think, something like that. I can't even think. Um, I'm with both of those, technically. But I do not have any of the Lotus products. I haven't tried them yet. Um, so I can't exactly recommend things all the way right now. But um, I'm with Faber Leak though. Has been a main one that I've been with. But you guys know I'm affiliated with a bunch of different ones. Which means that I have discount codes for you guys. Um, and the cool thing with Faber Leak though is that when you sign up as a customer, you get 10% off, um, which is really nice. All I have been drinking is water. I haven't... Oh, shoot. I forgot my water downstairs. You should remind me. Um, I haven't had a soda and tea since... Yeah, I definitely drink quite a bit of caffeine, but it's to keep myself, uh, with sugar and all this stuff because y'all breastfeeding is exhausting. Um, and it takes a lot out of you. Are you still? Yes, of course. Yes. I'm still with you can be. They are like, I think they're the most products I have is you can be products because they keep coming out with like incredible products that I just like, that's my number one affiliate company, honestly. Um, I've kind of, you know, I'm still with a bunch of other ones, but like my number one source of um, income, I guess what I want to say, is when you guys are ordering from You Can Be, and it's legitly my favorite. Um, I enjoy all the other companies I'm with and stuff that I'm affiliated with, but like, I feel like You Can Be is my number one because I am constantly either receiving PR products from there or I'm also ordering myself. Even when I'm receiving things, I'm ordering myself. So, that is definitely one of the big sources of my income is from people ordering from You Can Be because like I said, it's literally my absolute favorite. Especially, they keep coming out with new products. Every time I think they're going to, like, take a break, it's like, no. Uh, no, I do not, Sarah. I left it a while back. And honestly, my reasoning is there's a lot of new formulas and stuff and I just I'm not able to use them so I just kind of took a step back and not with it anymore and I am not mad about it either because honestly I'm kind of happy I'm not with any not any how do I say this not any corporate company, I guess the way I want to say. That's going to that's be how I explain that. Is not with any corporate company where I have to do a quota. Because I don't have no quota. The only time I have quotas is when they ask me nicely if I would do a video for them or something like that that, they'll, that they pay me for. So... <laughs> And like I said, I wouldn't use these products if I didn't love them. I wouldn't recommend them if I didn't love them. So, hi Katie. I'm not with anyone anymore. I do essential oils. Nice. Yeah, I, the only one I'm fully with right now is Favor Leak. And that's because I'm obsessed with their foundation. I love this foundation. It is my favorite and I don't plan on going to another foundation. Because the prices for this is amazing. 
Plus, this is reusable. Like, literally after this, this um, compact is done, I can refill it. And I'll still have this, basically. Hi, Ashley. How are you? Anyway, I get sidetracked. <laughs> Plus, it just looks really pretty. But this foundation is more like... It's definitely a medium coverage, I feel like. Um, I feel like if you do two coats of it or something, it could be a full coverage, but I do feel like it's a more medium coverage. I'm good. How are you? I feel like it's more of a medium coverage. Um, but like, it looks natural. I guess the way I want to say it. Like, it's more natural than a lot of other foundations. That just, like, you can tell you're wearing foundation. I just feel like this is smooth and pretty. Getting kicked a lot. What do you mean? Oh, duh. Sorry, my brain. Nice. Those are, that's always good. She's meaning because she is um, pregnant with a baby girl. Yeah, my brain had to like think for a minute. Think about Sensi, but haven't decided yet. I like Pink Zebra too. I've heard good things about, um, Pink Zebra and Sensi. I've heard good things. I do not plan on going to any other, um, type of direct selling company, technically. Affiliate marketing is my thing. Plus reviews. When I review products for companies and things like that. I love doing that. Hi, Jordan. How are you? Long time no see. Hi, Joanne. How are you doing? Mm, I think we need black eyeliner and not brown because this needs to stand out a little better. Mm, what black eyeliner do I have? How do you get into reviews? I see a lot of people do it. Um... You talk with, um, technically, you get in contact with, um, company-wise and stuff. Like, for example, I got in contact with somebody, um, with iMethod and stuff. And they're the ones who got me directed to do reviews. And then it kind of progressed from there. I wish, let's use this one. I'm trying to think how to explain it fully. Hi, Michelle. How are you? How are you guys doing? This blue is so freaking pretty and poppy. Very poppy. Okay. I'm going to take a little bit of the powder blue. Go right under the eye with it. Just so we kind of go in with that. I did notice my camera keeps on like focus. <laughs> That's kind of fun. In and out focus a little bit. Interesting. I don't know why it does that though. Uh, 
Okay. Let's go with a little bit of eyeliner. Ooh, a little bit dried out. Yikes. There we go. It's a little better, but yikes, this might be a little dried out. I might have to mess with that. Okay, hold on. Oh, I even said that I'm going to have to get eyeliner soon. That's sticky liner. This is a daily eyeliner. The new brow pencils I got are a little hard to open. Oh, yeah. Where are those from? Yikes. This is the old one. Hi, Molly. I'm going to have to throw this one out. That's the old one. The new one. Where'd it go? There it is. Yep, we're going to bust open the new one. Because... The old one is not wanting to work. It's very dried. Here we go. The other words, my, my only written on them, my only. Oh, not this. Oh, okay. That's probably the name of the brand. There we go. I think that works. I feel like this is a little thicker on like that part, but other than that, it looks pretty. Stereoscopic. Something I don't know. Oh, okay. Alright, I'm going to do a lift. Oh, okay. My orange meringue Faber Lake freaking lip balm. I love this stuff. Hydrates the lips. This is more of a matte eye. I feel like I haven't done that in a little while. I feel like I always have a little bit of shimmer on it. But we are not adding shimmer to it. We're just adding shimmer a tiny bit in the inner corner, not on the lid. I'm just going to put it right here. And I'm right there. Close. 
people on my daughter that's not her at all. There we go. What do you guys think so far? Let's go in with a little bit of mascara. How are the dogs doing with the baby boy? They love the baby boy. They love him. They do. They love him. And I haven't actually been doing the inner of my lashes. Hi, Shelby. I've only been doing, like, the outer. go back over with the curler um mascara that's so sweet yes yeah they they love him anytime um i have him and stuff like that um usually pressures like she wants to take him from me <laughs> She treats him like, uh, basically he's a puppy and she, like, wants to take him. It's kind of funny. Alright, let's go in with the brow slash eyeshadow palette here. This is how we're going to do our brows today. I'm going to go with the, the darker one. I actually really like how thin my brows look with this powder. Here we go. And then, I'm going to take a little bit of highlight. And a little bit here too. And then, Renew Lippy, what color lip should we do, you guys? What color? Tell me, tell me. What color should we do? Again, we use the Nostalgic 48 Color Makeup Palette by You Can Be. I'm obsessed with this palette. It has all kinds of gorgeous colors. And we used a lot of this one, this one, and this one. Pink? I should do pink? Okay. Pink, 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 pink. Let's do... Pink should we do? Hot pink? This pink? That's awesome, Teresa. Don't you love it? Okay, this pink. Or this pink. One, two, or... Yeah, one or two. One 
one or two? Comment down below. One or two. First one. Yes, love it. So the dark one? The dark pink? Okay. Dark pink? Dark pink? Actually, let me see if, there we go. Pretty? What do you think? Very pretty, love it. Okay, cool. I like it too. I might use these in a little bit. Absolutely gorgeous. Thank you. What do you guys think of the eyeshadow look? What do you guys think? What do you guys think? I forgot how matte these are. It's because they're really matte. You look great after having a baby. That's what I've been told by multiple people, actually. Because I am back to being tiny, tiny, tiny. Like, it happened in an instant, basically. After pregnancy. For me. For me, it did. Um, because of so much of the pressure and everything. Other than being in my tummy because a baby... Also, was all in my legs. So, as soon as I gave birth and all that kind of stuff, you know, from C-section wise. Um, after all of that, that is when my tummy, how do I say that? Deflated, I guess, the way I want to say. Deflated and I, I'm back to being like really freaking skinny again. Really skinny. <laughs> I might even be a little skinnier than I, well, no, I'm not because I'm back to being 115 pounds, so. Do you guys want to see how skinny I am again? Just curious. Are you curious? <laughs> I feel like most days I though, I am mostly in like an exercise bra and PJs and stuff sometimes. That's usually how it is. Okay, let me get out of this chair. You look amazing. Thank you. Yeah, see? Back to being skinny. That line never went away though. See? Back to being skinny. It's weird. It definitely is weird because like my stomach just feels weird. Because obviously it's like, how do I say it? Pudgy? Like the way the feeling is, it's pudgy. 
it's definitely weird because it's it's pudgy feeling like the actual skin like of my stomach i guess the way i want to say like it's squishy squishy and whatever i don't know how to say it like it's not solid which is just weird so and a tmi thing but um i am still having like i'm still bleeding some um not too much but my c-section the actual like stitch area and everything it looks great um it looks really really good i actually have an appointment in a week um in like a week i have an appointment um because it's my six six week postpartum or something something like that postpartum appointment so we will feel like that for a little while yeah yep i'm sure it's fine for the most part and everything though my body is feeling better i just have to i do have to like i don't remember picking these up um i do have to get used to eating again only part is what i mean wow that's pretty <laughs> sorry um i do have to um figure out again what i can eat again because um still after pregnancy there has been a couple things i'm still not able to eat um and that probably will be a thing probably but it's fine um there's a lot of stuff though i have been eating again so there is that will help you lose weight uh i don't want to lose any more weight i really don't i actually don't want to lose any more weight because i feel like if i lose more weight that's just not healthy for me i need to stay where i'm at or gain a little um because i am skinny y'all i and i'm not saying that to brag or anything like that either like i love being skinny but i really like i don't need to lose weight i really do not um because i don't think that would be healthy for me so i hope not um i know it's draining <laughs> it's definitely draining um it's draining it's exhausting I have been pumping though more um, because we feel like he's tongue tied and is not able to latch some of the times. So I have been pumping too um, to also help that. But he also already drinks formula um, because of what the pediatrician recommended for um, his weight. Because he's growing, but he's growing like slowly. So, but apparently that happens. So, any other questions from y'all? And you guys can ask any personal questions when it comes to like the breastfeeding or any of that kind of stuff, baby stuff, any of that kind of stuff. I am happy to talk to you guys because I am learning as I go. So, and if it helps somebody to like tell somebody something about it. I have no problem with helping somebody or talking about it and stuff because, I don't know, I'm an open book. Speaking of open books, though, you guys, um, if you guys haven't seen that soon, there will be a holiday coloring book out um, that I designed. Um that I designed and created and it will be on Amazon so it will be on Amazon soon but if you guys haven't snagged the dog coloring book or um or the other um like the other coloring book and stuff like that like make sure to snag them those could be great gifts for Christmas and stuff um, and I know it's not even, not even Thanksgiving yet, but 
I'm just giving y'all a heads up and stuff that if you are wanting to get any of those, definitely snag them. Um, they could be great Christmas gifts and stuff too. I already know that there is quite a few people and stuff like that that are loving the dog coloring book. Um, my bestie Kim, her daughter, absolutely loves that coloring book. I have a couple pictures of her coloring with it and stuff, so. And then, um, I have a couple other people and stuff that have snagged the original one, the very first one that I made and stuff. And, um, they love that one too, so. Hi, Wilma, how are you? So, yeah, if you guys are thinking about any of that kind of stuff, definitely go and snag them. Um, they're great gifts for anybody. Anybody who loves the color and stuff. And if you guys are not following my YouTube channel, um, make sure to do so. It is down below in the link tree. It should be. There should be a link to go straight to my YouTube channel. So make sure to subscribe. Um, because you guys will see a little more of me over there. Um, because I do just like the regular day, weekly type of vlogs. And then also I'm starting to do um, digital planning more over there. And in general, some digital coloring and coloring in general and stuff like that too over there. So just for a relaxing type of thing and just to kind of like, you guys get to see a little more of my life over there. So, cause I vlog over there. And you guys, thank you so much for subscribing. If you're already subscribed, I thank you because you are part of it. I have hit apparently 103 subscribers. So, that's been really awesome, um, and I'm very proud of that and happy. So, that's been a really, that was a really nice thing to also see. And this is the setting spray. If you guys have not, also, this is another product from You Can Be. I know. You Can Be, You Can Be, I know. There's a lot of that. <laughs> um, my discount code with You Can Be is BU15. B E Y O U 15 um, is my discount code for you guys. So, this is awesome though because of how much is in this. This is gonna last a while. So, as soon as this is out, I'll buy another one. So, I hope you guys are having a fantastic rest of your Friday. Um, and I will see you guys next time. So, bye!